The Bible says in 1 John chapter 4, verse 1 to 3, Beloved, believe not every spirit, but try the spirits whether they are of God, because many false prophets are gone out into the world. Hereby know ye the Spirit of God. Every spirit that confesseth that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh is of God, and every spirit that confesseth not that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh is not of God. And this is that spirit of Antichrist, whereof ye have heard that it should come, and even now already is in the world. I confess that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh. Now, verse 15, 1 John chapter 4, verse 15. Whosoever shall confess that Jesus is the Son of God, God dwelleth in him, and he in God. I confess that Jesus Christ is the Son of God. Now, 1 Corinthians chapter 12, verse 3. Wherefore I give you to understand that no man speaking by the Spirit of God calleth Jesus a curse, and that no man can say that Jesus is the Lord, but by the Holy Ghost. I confess that Jesus Christ is the Lord. So, and if you're wondering why I'm doing this, it's because the Bible gives us a test on how to test the Spirit, you know, try the spirits, that kind of thing. And these are the tests, how, how to tell someone's truly saved and who's not saved. Confessing that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh, that Jesus Christ is the Son of God, and that Jesus Christ is the Lord. So that's the test, and I confess, I confess it again to reiterate, I confess that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh, I confess that Jesus is the Son of God, and I confess that Jesus Christ is the Lord. Okay? So that's the, that's the test, I confess. So God bless you. Goodbye.